Hello and welcome to the orientation session for our graduate program in vision rehabilitation at the University of Montreal School of Optometry. You can also find out more about the program on Facebook on our page at Vision Rehabilitation. The School of Optometry of the University of Montreal is placed downtown on the island of Montreal in Quebec, Canada. We have English and French streams for our graduate programs. And as an English speaking student, you can take our basic science applied and clinical stream for conducting a research based master's degree or you can go into the clinical option, which is our visual impairment and rehabilitation degree. This master's degree uh, contains 45 credits and can be completed inside of four trimesters full time. The program itself can be completed within 16 months. And these 45 credits are divided into 60 credits that are purely coursework eight credits that are part of the internship, and seven credits that focus on a research project. The program itself is designed to set up students for their certification exam through the Academy for Certification of Vision Rehabilitation and Education Professionals. And our graduates are prepared to take this exam the moment they have completed their internship. The purpose of our project, of our program, is to train professionals to assess the needs and intervene with people of all ages with a partial or total visual impairment. We also aim to prepare future professionals for applied research on visual impairment and its rehabilitation. The program is divided into three concentrations. The first concentration is vision rehabilitation therapy, which focuses on site substitution. The second one is low vision, which focuses on sight enhancement. And the third one is orientation and mobility, which focuses on independent travel. No matter which one of these streams you're interested in, we have local, national and international internship sites that are available where you can complete the practical components of your degree. In vision rehabilitation therapy, the focus is on working with people whose remaining vision is not sufficient to work visually or who are functionally or completely blind. Here, the intervention strategies focus on the use of sound and touch as an interaction modality. And people learn, for example, how to teach Braille, how to use Braille, or how to work with tactile aids. In low vision therapy, you are working with people who still have remaining vision that can be maximized in order to improve function. Here you're looking at strategies of using lighting and magnification, and you train with optical, non-optical, and high technology aids. In the orientation and mobility stream, you're working with people of all levels of visual impairment across the spectrum and also across all ages in order to teach and facilitate how people travel independently and orient in space whether that is in familiar or unfamiliar environments, or whether it is indoor or outdoor. The ideal applicant has an undergraduate degree in occupational therapy, psychoeducation, psychology, orthoptics, kinesiology, gerontology, or any other health-related or health-allied discipline. You want to have an appreciation for new technologies, and you want to be engaged when using these technologies, enjoy teamwork and problem solving, want to help others, and above everything else, you want to have a sense of empathy that can facilitate how you interact with your clients. There are many different employment opportunities. Of course, within the Canadian context, the main employer of our graduates is Vision Loss Rehabilitation Canada, formerly known as the Canadian National Institute for the Blind, and there are rehabilitation centers across the country and across the continent where you can work in a private or a public setting. We have graduates that work in education, some that work in applied research, and there are some that work in industry, but also, of course, you have the opportunity of working in the context of university teaching. Opportunities for employment are uh, far and wide and numerous opportunities, especially uh, in 
regions where you would not necessarily think of it right away. The wide great, great north in Canada has great demand. Uh, we have um, students that are employed across North America, but also in Europe and elsewhere. So our placement rate is quite exceptional with almost all of our graduates having for currently full-time employment. In order to be admitted, you have to have an undergraduate grade point average of at least 3.0 out of 4.3, and you go through an admissions interview. Uh, application deadline for the program is the 1st of uh, February in every year for admission into the program for September 1st of the coming fall thereafter. You want to submit a letter of introduction uh, in, introducing us to your statement of purpose and why you are interested in the program, uh, letters of reference of people that can judge your ability to engage in this kind of work, send us your CV, and for international students it's especially important to provide a financial study plan uh, since fellowships to the program are only possible once you are actually admitted to the program and have started. In addition to this, you want to complete the online uh, application form at the University of Montreal. Student life is very strong at the University of Montreal. There are various organizations that facilitate not only the study components, but also quality of life. Here you have an image of our cohort that started in 2017, sending a big hello, and you can see that uh, this was quite a fun game. So I encourage you to contact our graduate program assistant in case you have any additional questions at tgde at opto.umontreal.ca tgde at opto.umontreal.ca and we look forward to your applications.